This is the Pentecost Convention Center, otherwise known as PCC, uh, established in 2013 by the Church of Pentecost for prayer, retreat, and conferences, primarily. Um, by the grace of God, early this year when COVID came in, um, the church offered this place up to quarantine patients, COVID patients, and then also to be used as isolation center. Um, all together, uh, over 3,000, roughly 3,200 patients were brought here. In fact, the place hosted them. Now, beyond the patients, the COVID patients themselves, there were those who were brought here after the reopening of the borders, the airports, who came as a result of the mandatory 14-day quarantine. So we had two categories of patients, the COVID patients themselves and then those who were brought in for isolation or for that matter, quarantine, 14-day quarantine. So uh, we played host to all this. All together, as I said, 3,200 patients. By the grace of God, no death was recorded here as a result of um, the COVID. And then also there was no transmission at all, no infection, zero infection, zero death here in Pentecost Convention Center. The church, in partnership with the state, uh, under our agenda of possessing the nations, in other words, bringing church to the nations, the doors of the nations, the government approached the church for this center and it was readily given. And this place was given to cater for uh, patients and by the grace of God, the paramedics and the security forces came and for a period of about seven months, uh, they were here. And the, the church gave the facility, not all, but the part that the, church, the government needed uh, to cater for the patients. That's the reason. And now it's over, over a month. There's nobody here now. But we thought that to rebrand, to get a place neat, we had to disinfect and fumigate to start operations. So we are opening the place up, as my brother just said. We are, we are reopening the place up. And this calls for this disinfection and fumigation. S some of us have been staying here right from 12th March. And we can tell you that the records are there to prove that there hasn't is zero death, zero infections. The staff have been screened, nothing happened. And so this place is safe. So whoever wants to come, the doors are open. Just come through the process and get yourself blessed. Because this place, the spiritual aura and the potency is high. Yeah. The viscosity of the anointing is too much for the place. So apart from the disinfection, prayer infection is also prayer disinfection is also going on. Let me put on record one when, when they came, the state brought her own materials mat mattresses bed sheets and what have you and all have been taken away we didn't use uh, uh beds uh mattresses for the covid patients no we packed all our materials yes we being the leading company in fighting the covid Yes, the, the management of PCC fall on us, come and then disinfect and then fumigate the facility for them. Because the place has been locked down since March of this year till now. And then there is no activity going on. So they call on us, come and then disinfect the place so that they can open it to the public for them to come and patronize. So for now, we came, we came to disinfect all the facilities here, including the compound, to, so that the place will be free from virus and then other bacteria. Now, I open this facility, this door to, to you. You will see our mattresses and pillows all packed up. All right? The state brought her own mattresses and pillows for the patient. They didn't use the center's materials. As you can see, everything is packed here for this floor. We go to the other floors, the same thing. We are holding rooms for our materials. And so people should be assured that our materials are all right for reuse. By the middle or towards the end of January, we hope to be ready for reopening and re-engagement. We're inviting everyone to come again. Our old patrons, our clients, old clients, are welcome back. In fact, I must say, it's on record, that even during the period, in just now, somebody has just called, 
they want to come. They know what this place holds for them, right? The promise it holds for them, the grace of God available, the aura, the aura spiritual aura here. And uh, so we are welcoming all of them and all other new people who want to come and patronize this place. It is open. This is the Pentecost Convention Center, otherwise known as Yesu Krum. In English, the city of Jesus. Here you come, you are blessed. I want to invite everyone to come over. Pentecost Convention Center, as I said earlier, is a place, a retreat and conference facility, Christian facility across the world. It's a global facility, international image. Um, we have rooms for individuals, for groups, um, accommodation, residential accommodation, um, several blocks, some with air conditions, some without. We have single rooms. We have those for executive, executive suites. Um, our ranges, the prices range between 20 Ghana cities to 300 Ghana cities. Our conference facilities are numerous. A 5,000 seater capacity auditorium. We have a 3,000 seater capacity auditorium, a 500, uh, 160, and then some other ones. We have a 1,700 seater eating place, a cafeteria that can sit at a go, 1,700 people. And then we also have an African village, um, thatched, thatch roofed, open space for programs as uh, events and so on and so forth. Um, it can sit a very good number of people. Anybody who wants to come to this place, you are assured of very good accommodation. You are assured of serene environment. You are assured of the presence of God. The aura of the grace of God is here. You will not come here and live here the same. Come and be blessed. We are expecting you from January 2021. To God be the glory.